Hi, I'm Fraser Quelch. I'm here at Athletic Evolution with Brad McEwen, with Vanessa Plimley, here with Curtis Woodley, an ex-pro rugby league player, avid rock climber, ice climber, defensive back. We actually just refer to him now as the physique. Brad's got his Superman outfit on. She's got her big smile on. So I'm here at Athletic Evolution, I'm Fraser Quelch and this is Vanessa Plimler and we're going to take you through the TRX Metabolic Workout A. So if you're doing this workout for the first time, I'll tell you a few things about it. First thing, our, our work intervals are going to be 30 seconds long. You're then going to get 40 seconds transition from one exercise to the next. But if it's a unilateral exercise like this first one we're starting off with, the single leg squat, we're going to go 30 seconds on one side, directly into 30 seconds the other without rest, so be ready for that. Again, I said 40 seconds to transition from one movement to the next and at the end of your set, so the whole sequence, you'll get three minutes to rest before you start the next sequence. Now Vanessa and I are just going to show you the first one and we'll talk a little bit about it and let you go. If you're in your first week, so your odd week, then you're only going to have to do the sequence three times through. If you're in your even week, week two, well, it's four times through, so I hope you ate your Wheaties. So I think we're ready to go. Vanessa, we've already adjusted the TRX, so it's about the bottom of the foot cradles are about eight to 12 inches from the ground. That's gonna allow us to transition nice and smoothly from one thing to the next. We're starting with that single leg squat. In most of the exercises, I'm gonna get Vanessa to show you a couple before it's actually time to go, so you get a chance to model it. We'll start that right now with that single leg squat. Make sure you start on your non-dominant or your dumb side. That's a good tactic. Okay, so she's gonna show you a couple notes she's got nice slack in the TRX at the top. Her weight is right over top of her feet. She's gonna do one more and now, ready at home? Here we go, 30 seconds. So she's driving down and up, trying to not rest too much time at the top. As soon as she's at the top, she wants to go down. We wanna be under continued movement. Remember, our goal is to get a good metabolic response here. So your heart rate is gonna go up. She's got great alignment, lots of, uh, her, her hip coupling is fantastic, right through the knees and ankles. She's rolling along here. Let's just do a couple more repetitions. Excellent job, two more reps, two more reps. Driving straight down and up, straight down and up, and immediately switch to the other side, beautiful. Perfect job, she's got again, still beautiful light grip here on the TRX. Driving straight down and up, keeping those hips right in line. And again, our goal here is to not use a TRX at all. Keep slacking the TRX the whole way, getting us ready to do a pure single leg squat. Now she's got about 10 seconds left to go. Don't rest at the top, Vanessa. Don't rest at the top. Keep it down and up. That's right. Resting at the top is for strength training, what you're doing on those off days. This is all about metabolic training and rest. Now we've got 40 seconds to transition into that atomic push-up. How are you feeling? Good. The legs are a little squirrely. Yeah. So as Vanessa gets ready to do this atomic push-up, you can see she's just down here on her side. She's dropping one foot through and then bringing the other one through and then rolling over, keeping her feet nice and pointed. So just to show you how to do this while you're resting at home, you're going to suspend that the feet straight up. So just go up into that plank. Notice she's got a great alignment, shoulders, hips, knees to ankles. Now she's gonna do a push-up, and she's gonna pull her knees right in, up the middle, and then straight down to another push-up. Or you can rest now, drop those knees down. So we're gonna go in about three seconds, get yourself set, Vanessa up, and go. Here we go, driving down and knees in. Good, straight down and knees in. You wanna keep these push-ups tight. If this push-up is too demanding for you, do the push-up from your knees. So just, Vanessa's gonna show us one, there's a the push-up, and then plank up, and knees in. Now keep going just the way you were before. Excellent, we got 15 seconds to go. Come on, Vanessa, driving, right here. Boom, knees to my hand. Notice how she's driving that hip up, knees to hand, good. Come on now, let's do two more, two more. Excellent job, you've got three seconds left at home. Drive it in, good, and rest, nice job. All right, so we're moving on to the next exercise, which is the low row. So what I want you to do is shorten the TRX all the way up, and once you've got it nice and short, you're just gonna sit down in front of the T-Rex getting yourself ready. Again, these transitions are quite quick, so you gotta make sure you're rolling through getting yourself set. We've got about 20 seconds left to go, so they're not, they shouldn't be feel frantic. Again, like John Wooden said, with these transitions, be quick, but don't hurry. <laughs> All right, if you're finding your heart rate is up a little bit, that's fine, that's exactly what we want. We're up in about uh, eight seconds, so let's show those first couple reps. She's gonna come straight up, she's got a big deep position, wide stance, and pull, and join us at home. Here we go. 
Perfect. Notice this great alignment, shoulders, hips, knees, ankles, all the way along as Vanessa is doing these exercises. Also, notice she doesn't have a huge hip thrust at the top. We want to keep that alignment nice and straight all the way along. 15 seconds to go. Now, if this is too steep, your feet are not rooted to the point. To the so she's backed up a little bit and can continue here, finishing the set. Nice job, Vanessa. Let's go a little bit faster. Come on now, three, three seconds, three seconds. One more rep, good, and rest. Nice job, we've got 40 seconds transition, moving to that balance lunge. And this is an easy transition. All we're gonna do is move back, grabbing onto the handles. Now remember for that single leg squat, what we had was we really, we tried to use just a light, light grip on the handles with no tension in the TRX. This one, we do wanna weight the TRX a little bit, okay? We're just driving that foot straight back. We're up in about 20 seconds. Let's just show a couple repetitions. Notice she's got, again, weight is over top. She's not leaning back against the TRX, but she's using it for balance and support. Notice she just kicks that knee so it almost touches, not quite. If you still have difficulty with this, you could put that foot on the ground, but we're trying to avoid that. So, join us at home, here we go. She's looking at me with this evil expression saying, hey, I've gone for 10 seconds already. Driving down, you're gonna feel this in your quadriceps and you can see Vanessa's quads are just fired up as she's doing this. But look at this great alignment through the shoulders and, and elbows. As she drives down and up, we've got about 15 seconds to go, dropping it down and up. I'm gonna give her just a little bit of a push down like this. It makes it a little bit harder. Good, and she's gotta control that as she rolls. We've got three more seconds. Let's do one more repetition. Good, and let's switch legs right away. Switch legs. Notice there's no rest with this one. We go right to the other side. Again, that heart rate should be coming up and that's just fine. Exactly what we want. We want that whole body metabolic tempo workout. Excellent job. We've got about 15 seconds to go. 15 seconds. And again, on this side, she's doing a great job keeping that knee nice and coupled right. I'm going to give her this little push again. She's giving me that evil expression. Perfect job. Last three seconds. Come on now. One more rep. One more rep. Nice, and now we get 40 seconds to transition to that final exercise, which is a side plank. Oh, yeah. A side plank is one of my favorites. This is a really demanding exercise, but we're going to show you a few different regressions and progressions as we go along. So make sure that the T-Rex is adjusted so it's about 8 to 12 inches from the ground. Vanessa's got her, is almost got her feet all the way in. Once you're there, roll over and then just lie down. It's best to be in the right position and then you can rest from there. So transition as quickly as you can. Now with this side plank, what we're looking for, notice we've got one foot in front of the other. That's She's got a heel to toe position. She's on the flat of her arm and we're up in about three seconds. So let's bring those hips all the way up and go. We're going to hold on to this for 30 seconds. Now look at this great alignment we've got. Her hips are nice and high. She's going to try and maintain contact with my hand the whole time. Now if you find this too difficult, take this hand and put it down onto your hip. That's going to lower your center of gravity just a little bit. If that's still too difficult, put your hand down on the ground in front of you just to help give you some support. And if you need to rest, rest. Let's have that arm come all the way up again though and push hard. We've got about seven more seconds. Look at this great alignment. we got a little bit of the tremor of truth going on. She's hanging on tight though. And now switch sides. Now to do this, her elbow goes to ground. Now she's nice and planked out and now she can move up on the other side. Notice rolling to the ground keeps her in the right position. Arm straight up. Here we go. 30 seconds on this other side. Again, we've got this great position and look at this beautiful body position. Nice and straight. Hip is perfectly high. Her core is working hard and that TRX is giving her a little bit of a wave that she's having to handle. we got 15 seconds to go. Breathe. Breathe. She's smiling too. Still smiling with it. Still 10 seconds to go. Keep it nice and tight. Nice and tight. Good. Squeeze. Good. She's got some great, great body alignment going on and rest. Nice job. So now you've got a three minute rest period before we have to do the next set. So again, if you're in week one, you've got two more sets to do after this one. So catch your breath, grab a drink of water and get yourself ready. If you're in week two, well then you've got three more sets to do. Grab a bigger drink of water. I hope you ate your Wheaties. So, Give this a try at home. Again, look for us for your next workout, which is going to be the TRX Metabolic Workout B, and we'll see you then.